Hi gamers, I'm Cyber Settler and today we're playing Osiris New Dawn. So today we are going to talk about the furnaces, um, what you can do with them and how you can upgrade them. So this is uh, pretty much the regular furnace and it has like this uh, main body and then this fuel, um, uh, like a fuel compartment here where you can load fuel so you have to for that i explain in a, another of, uh, of my videos you can check it out how to do that and you do it with a, with a tank you have to fill the tank with uh, fuel like hydrogen and then you have the main body and here you can interact with and um, craft different things and also you can upgrade it so one key thing is to be able to upgrade your <coughs> your furnace in order to progress in the game so in this particular case i've um, <coughs> upgraded this particular one to be able to cook stuff right so <coughs> you see that here you have some we have some some recipes that are locked because they uh, require some upgrades but for example you can see that I can with this particular furnace I can uh, make uh, water like clean water out of dirt water or uh, water out of snow and even I can make juice and grill alien meat and that's because I have um, uh, an upgrade that uh, allows me to cook with it so let's take a look at the other um, furnaces I have up here so here you can see that I have two other furnaces uh, one is a um, precipitation collector and it collects methane because in this uh, moon we have methane rain by the way, meth methane rain uh, is what happens on Titan, and on Titan it's very cold, so um, methane uh, behaves like water, but it, it has to be really cold to to have that, that phenomenon. So, um, I don't know if this is... Uh, <laughs> I, I'm not sure that this is uh, accurate, physical, uh, physically accurate, that you could have, like for example, the, the temperature could, could go down to minus 10 degrees or so and we have methane rain but also i don't know if if in the upper atmosphere you have such uh, low temperatures probably when the methane gets close to the surface it will just um, become gas but that's another subject and uh, this one is um it, this this one can create uh, water so we have um if 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 we input here um uh, oxygen and hydrogen we can uh, make water with this one so it's uh, pretty um, handy as well because then you are not limited to the water and on both of them you can see that the the, the this fuel compartment is gone and it's replaced with these batteries and that's an upgrade you can make to the to your furnace and of course you can have um, in one single furnace you can have several upgrades at the same time for for example if i upgrade this one to have a low heat upgrade it will let me cook on it beside being um, able to collect methane or water distillery upgrade to uh, create water um, but in this case, I was interested to um, to have both. Okay, now we have some company here. <laughs> I don't have um, much um, defenses. I should like <laughs> in this part of the base. I should just um, uh, surround this with some defenses. But you get the, the point, right? Um, or the idea you can have several um, furnaces so that for example um, water distilling uh, takes a long time 
so if if a furnace is distilling water then um, it's blocked you cannot uh, like do other things with them another visitor they want to learn as well um, and if you have them like this separated then you can use uh, one for distilling water while, while you're using the other for some other thing also this fuel um, thing it's uh, this fuel upgrade to to have a battery is very good because then you you free yourself from this uh, task of um, looking for uh, gas for fuel and having to to um, to put um, fuel in your to fit fuel into your furnace so this is a very important part of, of the game because as you progress you you want to cook for example to manage better hunger so for example here i have like this grilled um alien meat that is more uh, nutritious than the charred meat alien meat nutritional balance achieved and this is uh, very good also water is a resource that um, tends to 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 run out well, of course you can always salvage from other locations but um, as you use that it, you could end up having water short shortage so this um, also very um, nice so that's it uh, for this video so hope you find this interesting and hope to see you in the next one this is cyber settler signing off